Meghan Markle became the victim of a judgment epidemic from the moment she joined the royal family, but the attacks have grown harsher since the Duchess of Sussex became a mother, a global success coach focused on empowering working mothers said. Meghan has been judged with a fine-tooth comb and facing unfairly harsh criticism by social media users, Jamie Sarah said. These repeated attacks, which forced Kensington Palace in March to issue guidelines for users to follow when they address members of the royal family on Twitter or Instagram, are triggered most of the time by jealousy, according to expert Jamie Sarah. She told, similarly to the Duchess of Sussex, many of my clients are in high-profile executive roles and have to face judgment and jealousy on a regular basis, so I am well accustomed to support women who experience jealousy and judgment. The first thing that I highlight is that the judgment they receive is not about them, it's about other people's insecurities and ideals. Other people are judging themselves non-stop and so then they judge others, it's what I call a judgment epidemic. You just have to look at what people have said about Princess Diana, the Duchess of Cambridge, Sarah Ferguson years ago. And when it comes to Meghan, she fell victim of this epidemic since it was publicly announced that she was dating Prince Harry. From my point of view she has faced even more judgment than most. The attacks towards Meghan and the public scrutiny have increased in recent months, following the birth of Archie Harris in Mountbatten, Windsor on May 6, according to Miss Sarah who has noticed with other clients a trend of increased jealousy coming with motherhood. The expert at definitely definitely said, motherhood seems to be making this worse, there is definitely a strange sadistic relationship in the collective unconscious of our society when it comes to mothers. It seems that once a woman becomes a mother she is considered fair game for any and all criticism especially those who are high achieving and manage to juggle competing priorities alongside motherhood, this can be very intimidating for many. A lot of the judgment comes from within, people projecting their own insecurities. Insecurities by people who don't look perfect at all the time, though I'm sure at home Megan doesn't either, are no longer of childbearing age or who yearn for children but aren't partnered up. Insecurity is also projected onto others by those whose children have flown the nest wishing to do it all over again and judging themselves for raising their children imperfectly, as if perfection is even achievable, those who feel they didn't do as well as Megan appears to be doing when they were new mothers, as if they can even really know from photos, come on. And so on. Insecurity is everywhere and that's the root cause of judgment, not the person being judged. Meghan has been recently judged and, at times, ridiculed on Twitter for the way she was holding her three-month-old baby boy during the charity polo match. And just this week news of a trip to Ibiza to celebrate her birthday with Archie and Prince Harry have sparked outrage on social media. The Duchess is also more likely to become a target of jealous people and being the wealth and resources she can get access to, Ms. Sarah said. She continued. I think also many are envious that she has access to lots of help, nannies and doesn't have any financial concerns during this time when increasing numbers of women do, and are getting back to work quickly. They envy that she doesn't need to, and that shows up as them slagging her off, rather than being honest with themselves and admitting that they're actually just envious. There's a lack of self-awareness about the real cause for many. They just go into judgment automatically without seeing the path clearly.